unprepared. The man convicted of murdering Detective Benjamin Marconi could learn his fate this week. A jury last week found Otis McCain guilty of capital murder. Now they'll decide whether he gets death or life in prison. Eyewitness News reporter Zach Briggs joins us live from the Justice Center downtown with the latest in the sentencing phase. Zach. Well, more law enforcement taking the stand today. Text messages from Otis McCain's phone revealing the defendant's dealings with narcotics, including various forms of cocaine and marijuana. Now, De Detective Sergeant De Kyle Williamson brought to the stand today. He read through several text threads, these conversations taking place months before McCain shot and killed Detective Benjamin Marconi outside public safety headquarters. McCain acted as both the dealer and buyer of various forms of drugs based on Williamson's testimony, a move to give jurors an idea of who prosecutors say McCain is. Now, earlier in the day, Detective Justin Knox combed through pictures and internet searches found on McCain's cell phone. Data included videos and articles on how to disassemble Glock pistols and the state of defense discussing airing McCain's interviews with local media, including Ken's Five, where the defendant says he should walk out the front door when asked what should happen to him. Now, the defense is expected to introduce their witnesses this week. The trial resumes tomorrow at 1.30 p.m. Reporting live downtown, Zach Briggs, Ken's 5 Eyewitness News.